This is a part two of Jesus. Uh, that means the Messiah was the prophet of children of Israel. In Matthew 21, 11, the crowd answered, well, this is Jesus, the prophet. This is, the Bible is confirming that Jesus is a prophet. Matthew 21, 11. The crowd answered, this is a Jesus, the prophet from Nazareth in Galilee. What does it mean that Jesus is the son of David? In Matthew 1, uh, verse 33, the Lord will give him the throne of his ancestor David. 17 verses in the New Testament describe Jesus as the son of David. But the question arises, how could Jesus be the son of David? If David lived approximately 1,000 years before Jesus, the answer is the Christ or the Messiah was the fulfillment of the prophecy of the seed of David. Uh, in 2 Samuel 7 verses 12 up to 16. Jesus is a promised Messiah, which means uh, he had to be of the lineage of David. The genealogical uh, proof that uh, Jesus was a direct uh, descendant of Abraham and David uh, through Mary, Jesus' legal mother. The genealogy uh, in Luke 3 traces Jesus' lineage through his mother Mary. Jesus is a descendant of David by blood through Mary. As to his, uh, that means, uh, earthly life, Christ, or Christ Jesus was a descendant of David. Roman 1 3. In Matthew 1 uh, 33, your son will be a king of Jacob's people forever. And uh, his kingdom will never end, said. Uh, in Matthew 1 34, Mary asked the angel, How can this be? I am a virgin, said. Matthew 1 35, the angel answered, Here, the Holy Spirit will come to you, and the power of the Most High will overshadow you. Therefore, the Holy Child developing inside you will be called the Son of God. When we say it is the Son of God, he is not his father. Elohim God is not his father, but through righteousness. God said the King David is my firstborn son. God said to also Jacob, he is my firstborn. And he will be, that means, uh, God said that King David is my firstborn son. And he will be the ruler of all kings on earth. Psalms 89, 27. David is also told that one of his children would be God's son. 2 Sam, Samuel 7 verses 40 or 1 Chronicles 70 verses 30 regarding King Solomon. The later prophets uh, spoke of the faithful members of the people of Israel as God's children. Isaiah 43 uh, 6 or Hosea 1 10. Hosea 1.10 Yet the Israelites will be like the sand on the sheer shore, which cannot be measured or counted in place where it was said to them, You are not my people. They will be called the children of the living one. So that the, those who follow the commandment of God is what called the Son of God. In Matthew 1.36 uh, Elizabeth, your relative, is six months pregnant with a son in her old age. People said she couldn't have a child. 37 But nothing is impossible for God, said Gabriel. After that, uh, in Matthew uh, 1 38, Mary answered, I am the Lord's servant. Let everything you have said happen to me, said. Primarily, the, the, the title Son of David is more than a statement of physical genealogy. In theology, it is a messianic title. When people refer, refer to Jesus as the son of David, they mean that he was a long-awaited deliverer, the fulfillment of the Old Testament prophecy of Isaiah. Jesus was addressed as the son of David several times by people who by faith were seeking mercy or healing. The, the woman whose uh, daughter was being uh, tormented by a demon Matthew 50 22
and as the two blind men by the way side, Matthew 20, 30, all cried out to the son of David for help. The titles of honor they gave him declared their faith in him as a Messiah or prophet, calling him the son of David, didn't express their sense of his deity or dominion and the power, but it is respection and as they were calling him son of David expressed their faith that he was a Messiah and a prophet. In Matthew 21, 11, the crowd answered, This is Jesus, the prophet. This is, the Bible is confirming that Jesus is a prophet. Matthew 21, 11, the crowd answered, This is a Jesus, the prophet from Nazareth in Galilee. Matthew 21, 12, Jesus entered the temple court and drove out all who were buying and selling there. He overturned the tables of the money changers and the bench of those selling off. In John 9:17, then they turned again to the blind man. What have you to say about him? It was your eyes. He opened it. The man replied, he is a prophet. This is eyewitness. This is a prophet. Despite every, everything that was unexpected about him, Jesus truly is the Messiah, the higher, of course, promised to Israel through David, as well as higher to the promised God, made to Abraham, the patriarch, for the blessing of the nation, Matthew 1, 1. The genealogy of Jesus, the Messiah, this is the genealogy of Jesus, the Messiah, the son of David, the son of Abraham. Matthew 1, 60, Jacob was the father of Joshua. So, for the time being, this is our part 2 session. We will continue our part 3. Thank you for your listening.